All right, this is the Swonder Direct 10 foot stand up paddle board. I'm gonna see which is faster. Obviously we all know probably the outcome was what it's gonna be. Um, the hand pump, single action hand pump, or uh, the electric pump that plugs into a, a 12 volt um, cigarette lighter in your vehicle. Uh, comes with a nine foot cord. So even if you have an adapter or a, um, a plug-in at the front of your vehicle, um, it's gonna reach all the way back um, or outside the door to um, help inflate your, your paddle board. So let me give it a test here. I'm gonna do the uh, single action hand pump first there, and then we'll see what the um, electric pump can do. Um, by the way, this electric pump comes with a bunch of different adapters here depending upon what's gonna fit your paddle board. You might have a friend that this might fit theirs, but there's one on here that will fit this one to direct paddle board. So let me start out with the hand pump and give it a timer here and we'll get going. So let me put this here. So obviously I'm not gonna count in the time. Just connecting it here, make sure the valve is out. All right, we're all good there. Let me set my timer. And we're going. I'm gonna pump this up to 15 PSI. And there's a gauge on top here that I will look at here when it starts to get more firm. Doing good. We're at right now about three PSI. So we got some ways to go here. right now, eight PSI, so over halfway there. We're at 10. This last little bit. 
gets really tough now. There is 11. We're at uh, 12. There is 13 and a half. That is 14 and a half. Come more. And there's 15. So, on my watch, five minutes, 12 seconds. And obviously, I'm kind of winded. So, you can see that the hand pump might have its disadvantages. If I can catch my breath here. So, disconnect that. So, about five minutes. Five minutes, 12 seconds to get it fully deflated to um, a firmness of 15 PSI. So the firmer you get it, um, the more stable it's gonna be, the more you're gonna feel comfortable in the water. So let me hook up the electric and give that one a whirl. So in the meantime, I'm gonna deflate this again. plug my cigarette lighter in here. This vehicle happens to have a port in the back. This lights up then. Um, and you can program it to uh, the PSI that you want. So I obviously want it on 15 PSI. And it's gonna be, I'm gonna put it, the adapter on there and I'm gonna turn it on. Let me make sure that's fully deflated first so we have a fair, fair playing game, right? And to make sure we have a fair playing game, I'm going to use the advantage of the pump to deflate it. So there's an inflate and a deflate side. I want to make sure that is up there. Put the adapter in and turn on. And you'll see there it's taking all the air out. So we're at a level, level playing field here when I get uh, it going up. So obviously right there you could tell um, to the advantage of gonna having the, the electric pump is I'm already winded, I've already got a workout in. I mean, are you gonna feel like paddle boarding? Yeah, you are, but you're gonna be tired. So just to rest up a little bit uh, before you get down in the water. So take all that air out of there. Still working its way out. 
all the way up front there. So this is a 10 foot board and it's uh, six inches thick when it's fully inflated, 36 inches across. So it looks to be pretty compact down there. Another advantage too of having the deflating is when you're packing it up to put it back in the backpack, um, you can get a little bit tighter. You get all that air worked out of there. So let me switch the, the port on the pump here. We're ready there. And let me reset my stopwatch. So I have this pre-programmed to 15 PSI. Once it hits 15, it's gonna automatically stop. So here we go. So obviously now is the best time um, if you were just using the electric pump and you're out at the lake or a river or whatever, um, just putting your paddles together, um, getting your life jacket out there, um, just getting ready for the, for the fun trip you're gonna have and letting the electric pump do what it does. So let's uh, watch it here. So we're at 36 seconds. Once it does inflate to a point, um, you'll hear like the compressor more start in. So right now it's just like getting it ready. And then once the compressor starts, you'll hear it. And it's now forcing more air in there in that space. So you see it sort of fell out there. So it's at two and a half PSI right now. So it's at two and a half and it's still working. Um, it's about two minutes and 15 seconds into it. So I'm thinking I might be a little bit ahead of it, but we'll give it a, a look here. It's up to four. It's up to six now. 
It's up to six and we're about almost uh, four minutes. to eight so it's got seven more to go still and right now right now we're at the five minute mark and it's at about eight and a half Six and a half minutes, and it's about at ten point eight. There's eleven. There's 12 PSI right there. Thirteen. It's got two more PSI to go. It's Thirteen and a half. We're at eight and a half minutes so far.
14. 14 PSI at nine minutes even right there. So this, like I was saying before, this will shut off when it hits the uh, programmed PSI that I put in for it of the 15 PSI. There's 14 and a half. Coming up almost to 15, there's 14.92. And there's the 15 right there. So we'll stop the clock at nine minutes and 50 seconds. So I wanna say I'm, I'm excited and I'm happy that I beat it. However, I'm pretty tired from um, pumping it up. So obviously if you're a first time doer, you're not gonna wanna um, do that by hand. Um, so using the, the electric pump is going to have its advantages. So let me unplug it here. So there it is. So once again, like you can use uh, the, the, the deflate port on this side. Um, if you wanted to, to deflate it, get all the air out and make it a lot easier to uh, put in the backpack. So um, having the electric pump does have its advantages. Um, obviously from not being so tired after doing it and you could like sit there and get your paddles ready, life jacket, um, stuff you wanna bring along on the board with you. So there's a test. Um, I beat it, which is awesome. Um, take a look at this Wonder Direct stand-up paddle board, inflatable stand-up paddle board and Check in the uh, description below. There's a there's a discount um, that I'm offering with it, and give it a try. Stand up paddle board is amazing. Great leg, ab, arm workout. Um, you'll have a fun time on the rivers and the lakes wherever you go. So there it is. Check it out. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and we'll see you guys next time.